and the results are in. Conclusive. I'll be live in studio until the election is called, which means Christmas came early for those of us who love to sleep in our work socks. A blow to democracy, a boon to TV newscasters. But the million dollar year end bonus question is, when will we know who's won the election? My guess is sometime in the future. What the ass? Eh, it's always been kind of a lose-lose for me. We were winning. What happened? Besides adding in the cities where all the people live. I, I could put the COVID-19 task force on the hunt for voter fraud. We're not really doing much else. Bring the tear to my eye. Oh, no, no, wait, that's the knockoff cologne I bought from a street vendor at 4 a.m. on my way out of Kurt's magic titty parlor. This is? Awesome! It is way past my bedtime! Oh, come on. Who do I have to drone to get some results? Relax! I was begrudgingly elected the nominee, and I'll be begrudgingly elected president! Calm down, guys. We just need to win one of the states where Hillary was burned in effigy. I'm feeling a little tense. Anybody got 10,000 cigarettes? Chuck, what does this mean for infrastructure wage? We may not know the winner, but at least we know it's not Bernie Sanders. And the Democrats have lost at least six seats in the house. Embarrassing, and that's coming from Chuck Todd. Ouch. God damn it, Nancy! What did you think was gonna fucking happen? Everybody told you that this was gonna fucking happen! I called you every goddamn day telling you this was gonna fucking happen, you fuck- I won. I won! Looks like dragging myself across the bathroom floor of the Republican Party, reaching into the toilet and hugging the biggest turd in the bowl was all worth it. That was a close one for old Susan Collins, but I knew I could do it if I stuck to my principles, whatever they may be. Either I get four years of judicial appointments or four years of congressional gridlock. Either way, I'm whistling Dixie till God sends a big old thunderbolt through my skull. Who did they say won? Eh, who cares? I'm gonna try to go all four years without finding out. L-M-F-A-O-A-F. Okay, so now who, like, wants to help me build a new self-driving death trap? Well, Jill, we won, right? It feels like we won, right? Uh, am I crazy or we not? We sure I... did. Now get out there and tell the American people that the next few days to months are gonna suck ass. Don, whatever happens after this, you'll always be the greatest disappointment of my life. <laughs> Thanks, Dad. Now get out there and tell the American people that the election has been compromised by an army of Venezuelan single moms. Shut up, that was my idea. Hey, gang, thanks for coming to this month's White House Super Spreader event. I'm gonna keep this tradition going till I'm the last man wheezy. Don't be fooled, people. I won this election fair and square. I don't care what the pundits say, what the papers say, or what the voters say, I'm not giving up. As God is my witness, I will never stop fighting the will of the American people. <laughs> Hello, Delaware! I'm here to give a brief, hasty speech because I'm awake after nine and it's as cold as Blitzen's tits! Ain't it great, folks? I want a nail-biter against the devil! I can't believe so many of you went out and voted for me during a pandemic! If you get sick, just send me your $30,000 hospital bill and I'll autograph it! The pollsters must stop counting the fraudulent votes in Wisconsin, Michigan, and Pennsylvania. But keep counting Georgia. I think I got a shot there. By the way, is it my election night speech so much better than Biden? I even provided pre-show entertainment. Fox News on big screen. These Georgia numbers are not looking good for President la, Trump. La, 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 la. Moving on. I'm the one man who can bring this divided nation back together. Sort of like when a delivery guy falls off his bike and a bunch of pedestrians scramble over to help him and realize, wow, we're all totally different, but we're all super worried about this guy. We won Ohio, we won Texas, and we won Florida twice. We're definitely going to win that state with all the lazy-eyed weirdos in work boots. What's it called? Fuxville? Oh, yeah, Pennsylvania. Now, Donald Trump's gonna tell you he's president, but don't listen to that lunkhead unless he's talking about how fracking is the wave of the future. We need to exhibit patience, people, like Jill does when I use the blender and get strawberry guts all over the ceiling. I can't believe I lost Arizona. And here I was thinking I turned a corner with John McCain's ugly pig family. If I could take back the insults I threw at Donald Trump at that White House correspondence dinner that led him to run for president and destroy democracy, I would. Actually, no, I wouldn't fuck that guy. I'm being told some repo guys from Deutsche Bank are pulling up in the driveway, so if we could just hit the lights and pretend no one's home. Hello? I'm here to collect $400 million worth of stuff. Shh, 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 shut up, shut up. 
Okay, I think we're good. Well, am I gonna have a nutso time the next four years trying to get anything done while conservatives and progressives both hate my guts? I'm entering office with the slimmest of mandates, a Republican Congress that claims I'm Castro and a heart that's 78 years old. But the victory's already won. We made Donald Trump a one-term president by replacing him with a one-term president. <laughs> You thought you could get rid of me, America, but I'm never going away. I'm like Freddy Krueger on some serious anti-inflammatory steroids. Don't worry, I'm not gonna let Democrats steal this election. We're taking this all the way to the Supreme Court. I got my justice buddies watching my back. Nerdy guy, abortion lady, and my main man, I wanna say, Bill Kavanaugh. Assuming he's not blackout drunk for the next week and a half. For every MVP, I'm gonna take a headshot. That's how we know who win, or I die! Don't worry, Pennsylvania loves me. I'm from West Philadelphia, born and raised. Oh, wait, that's Fresh Prince. Biden wins Pennsylvania, and that's the game. The baseball game. The presidential baseball game. Can anyone give me a lift to Argentina? Oh.